Welcome back, guys. Gainesville Homes Daily. Ryan here again. Um, got five homes to review today. Before we jump into that, just a quick note that I will be out of town at the Final Four. Can't wait. It's in Dallas, Texas this year, and I'll be back uh, Tuesday evening, so we'll start back videos on Wednesday um, for those of you wondering why we're not going to do videos probably for the next few days. Um, 14142 Catbird Drive is the first one at Meadows and Morris Farm. It's a townhome, interior unit, stone, and uh, some vinyl siding, three bedrooms, three and a half baths with close to 2,400 square feet at 355,000. It was built in 2006. Um, nice two-car garage on this townhome as well. Nice huge open space as you can see, so plenty of square footage in this home. Um, it looks like, I can't tell if those are Corian countertops or just uh, some Formica ones, but um, looks like the cabinetry has been upgraded uh, you know, to a, a cherry and also um, some some black appliances as well. Rec room downstairs in the basement. Master bathroom. Looks like it backs up to the wooded common area as well, which is nice. And there's a little patio out in the backyard, which is fenced in. So 355000 This is in line with where many of these homes have been priced out for this uh, this type of square footage, close to 2,400 square feet. So um, decent option there. 13222 Triple Crown Loop is located in the Heritage Hunt subdivision, the active adult, 55 plus years of age and older community. Standard sale of 430000 Three bedrooms, three baths, 0.143 of an acre, 2,300 square feet. No basement, so both levels are above grade. Um, we'll go through some of the pictures here. This is the Addington model. Um, we got obviously a two car garage there, vinyl siding, hardwood floors on the interior, granite in the kitchen, some oak cabinets. House shows pretty good. Um, I think that the price point is pretty much right in line with where many of the other ones have been selling over there. Um, like I said, they are a wide range, anywhere from three hundred fifty to five hundred to six hundred thousand dollars over there. So I think that this is priced decent. The, the lots uh, okay size. It's not um, not that big, but um, you, you are getting you know decent amount of square footage on the interior. Tons of amenities with the community center, golf, tennis, uh, two seventy five a month HOA fee. 1402 Spring Lake Drive. This is located at the Forest Lake Estates subdivision. It's a contemporary home, as you can see here from the outside, but it's on 1.411 of an acre, located in Haymarket. Um, we do have a two-car garage, which you can see is kind of a side load there. Built in 1980, um, located on a cul-de-sac. I think the best thing about this is you're going to be kind of secluded in the woods, with also um, you're getting an eight, almost an acre and a half on this property, which is nice. Here's the interior. It's been updated kitchen. Tile backsplash, granite counters, stainless appliances. It's hard to say, but it looks like this could be a potential flip with many of the upgrades that have been done on this house. Um, definitely a unique home, priced at three hundred ninety-nine thousand, roughly three thousand square feet. Um, so it's a good size home. I think for the acreage and the and the um, you know the square footage that you're getting, everything's pretty much been updated on the inside here. I think this is a decent price. I'm um, definitely maybe one to pay attention to for those looking for a different style and and, and just going for something that's um, you know out of the ordinary a little bit. I, I definitely think that's a, a decent home there. Four five two two Log Mill Road. This is located in Gainesville, split foyer on two acres. So you're getting some land here. Um, this is located um, if you're heading west on Sully Road to a right on the log mill. Uh, we've got 2,200 square feet with a two-car garage. Um, like I said, two acres, four bedrooms, three baths is going to be the big draw on this one, so you're getting quite a bit of, of land in Gainesville. Um, the interior, your, the square footage is somewhat limited, being only you know about 2,300 total. Kitchen's kind of small. Um, so I think this is really for a play on people that are looking for more of a yard, don't necessarily care about as much space on the inside of the house, but I think the price point is somewhat reasonable. Um, you know, for the acreage that you're getting here. Not thrilled with the inside of this home, but it's it's okay. 13580 Philly Court is located in Bridalwood, 315,000. We've got 2,336 square feet um, on this property. There's no pictures as of yet. I will say that this is probably towards the high end. Um, uh, price point for this subdivision was built in 2000, um, but the square footage is good, close to 2,400 square feet, so definitely one to keep on the radar. So quite a uh, Quite a few homes on today. I'm sure tomorrow there will be many more. If you'd like to schedule a showing, give us a call, 703-596-0011, or contact us through the website at Gainesville.
HolmesDaily.com. Have a great day, guys, and we'll be back at you next Wednesday. Take care and have a great weekend.